pesticides that could have been poisoned. Never accept food from Donald's friends. Um, that is a good point, actually. <laughs> Ellen and I are sitting in our dorm room when we hear a knock on the door. When I look outside, there's no one there. Someone is invisible. May I come in? Who's there? Minnie. 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 Why is she here? I don't know. Why can't I see you? Well, we know it's Minnie. You gave Minnie a voice. Uh, what's your voice again? Like? <laughs> uh. Hey, Minnie, cloak. May I come in? That wasn't it, but whatever. Minnie will have a different voice every time she speaks. <laughs> sure, I guess. Sorry. What's going on? A moment later, there's a shimmering in the air and Minnie appears. What? Who? When? Why? Teach ah! me! Oh. <laughs> Sorry. I, I'm trying to keep a low profile at the moment. I heard about what happened with you and the camera. Well... I don't blame you. I came to tell you some things that might not otherwise have heard. You might not otherwise have heard. Shush. Ah, Everyone she's gonna explain you things. You should listen. She gonna tell us why we shouldn't mix magic and science? Maybe. The reason so many things like cameras, CDs, are banned on campus is to prevent students from getting any ideas about mixing magic and electronics. It's very strictly forbidden. Mixing how? It doesn't matter how. Anything that comes close to those lines, and they'll crack down. Why? Does magic interfere with electromagnetic fields? Or the other way around? Minnie takes a deep breath. Let me go on a bit before I get back to that question, alright? Most people don't know even if they're born magical. They just under they just they're just told that it shouldn't be done. Or can't be done. They're taught not to ask. There are students here last year, or so I was heard about, named Musdet. I think it's Musette. Musette! The musical. Yeah. I think she was a snake. She got good grades and she got interested in magical technology. She had a good reason, but it didn't matter. She was just a student, a wild seed, and she was disobedient. She made her... that made her dangerous. You could hear the air quotes on that. She's like, dangerous. It was so they expelled her, around. stripped her magic, and wiped her memories, and they... Well, she's gone now. And they ate her fingers. Alrighty. I know already. If I don't behave, I could be expelled and lose my mem lose my mind. Professor Podsman told me that. You know that, in theory. But you might think that because you're on top of the, you're one of the top students in our class. But now it's true. You might think that you could talk to your way out. of you could talk your way out of it. Don't. Don't try to fight this. You said it was a good student with special circumstances, and it didn't save her. And because of that, I'm not going to answer your question. What? Why not? Because it might make you curious. I'm already curious. But you're also sensible. If you know what it's da if you know that it's dangerous, and you don't know exactly what the danger is, you want to experiment, will you? I don't know. <laughs> Look, I'm trying. I'm not trying to be mean. I'm just trying to help you. Do you think it's right to have these rules and keep them a secret? Don't ask me that. Ah. I'm sorry. I don't understand. Just listen. Yeah. 
close enough. <laughs> until you graduate, you don't have the right to, to... Until you graduate, you don't have the right to do a trial. So it's better to keep your head down and play along. Once you full... Once you're full members of of uh. <laughs> Once you're full members of society, then ask questions. It's the voices, isn't it? Mm, Certain no. voices make you want to say words certain ways. No, that's just me. Oh, no, I I was having that happen a little bit, but I was trying to stay on top of it. Do you understand what I'm trying to tell you? I guess. No technology, no questions, fine. Good. I really have to go. Don't tell anyone we talked about this, alright? She ducks out the door. I stick my head out after her, but the hall's already empty. That was weird. Yeah. So, you gonna give up on science? I can't. But... No one ever seems to understand what scientific reasoning means. It's like they're afraid of... The word. Huh? Nothing. I've got to think. I'm going to the library. I'll see you later. It's like Ellen walks out into the hall and suddenly we hear, Eureka! <laughs> like, <laughs> or she like, tries to walk out the hall and he's there like, I heard all of that. Yeah. All right. Ellen hurries away. She obviously had some kind of idea there. Yeah. Even halfway through that ex explanation. Maybe that won't turn out bad. If maybe she's just like, look, all I'm saying is blah. I'm not actually going to do anything. Just blah, you know? And like, or maybe she's going to find out why people are scared of science. I don't know. Uh, call cause creatures in the surrounding physical area to be drawn to the caster. Huh. Uh. Don't know if you'd want to use that. Maybe if we're using ourselves as bait. That's some delicious. It seems oh, very Damien. dangerous. I guess I could be like, there's a lot of monsters. Everybody come to me, and then once they get there, I teleport away from them. <laughs> like, see ya. So I like, now see I know guys. where you all are. See ya. You know? <laughs> all right. Oh, see, I thought you meant like teleport, uh, draw all your friends close by. And as all the enemies are closer, teleport away. Well, it so says, that the, the fence fend them off. It says draw them to the caster. It would depend on if they'd follow me after I teleported away or not, really. Uh, Ellen gets up early on Saturday morning. She returns after the mail and allowance is delivered, but only long enough to wave to me before going off to server detention. What should I do today? Steady. Because I'm still broke. Some students' library, but Minnie's nowhere to be seen. Studying. Magic. When Ellen returns from her detention, she seems to be lost in thought. Hey, was it awful? It was great. Huh? I talked to Professor Grabner. He's going to help me. He even apologized for snapping at me before. Yeah, way to go, Ellen. Huh. What's he going to help you with? Developing a proper line of study in magical phil philosophy. Uh, I just can't read. Philosophy. Philosophy. Yeah, you're like, damn it. I want to say philosophical or something. Velociraptor. I mean, <laughs> uh, philosophy. You mean like ethics? No, that's a moral. That's moral philosophy. Magical philosophy means studying how magic works. Remember Angela's paper on the Icarus effect? Things like that. Wait a minute. You mean the science of magic? Don't ah. You mean the science of magic? Don't you? Shh. Not here. Not yet. Get in bed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we need to wait for Virginia. Where's the camp? <laughs> it was just she made that same face. <laughs> Some people think that science only means electrical, electricity, and test tubes, and discretion. Any learning is science. Dissection. If you go about it a rational way. I checked with the library. I checked with the library and the professor. And there's nothing forbidden. There's nothing. There's nothing forbidden about studying magic. It's only technology they're afraid of. Ah. 
So she found a good way to explain what she was trying to say. Yeah, she just needed different words. Yeah. But you can still come up with theories and test them. Without using any inventions more recent than the pencil. They're like, you can study magic, just not with technology. That's what we're worried about. It just means I have to limit what I, what things I test for now. It's fine. There's plenty of things to study already. Every dungeon examiner is already a kind of science experiment because we come up with ideas to solve the puzzles. And then the tests come out. It just needs more organization. And that's what I'm good at, you know? You're good at lots of things. Like stealing. <laughs> shh. <laughs> eh? I, I just said right. No. Oh, no. You said shh. Then I said right. Well, I mean, my audio bugged out for a second. Anyway, I think this is what I needed, what I wanted to do. I'm going to use what I already know about planning and the scientific method to get started on the real Opus Mangus. Opus Mangus, instead of Magnum Opus. Uh. Still would have, Magus Opus probably would have seemed more, yeah, whatever. It's convoluted. Can I help? Sure. Dude, I want to help. <laughs> <laughs> I need more time to plan first. So many things have gone wrong for Ellen, but hopefully now she's really found her place. Good for her. I'm very glad that didn't turn out terrible. Because <laughs> I was like, oh god, Ellen, don't get expelled. It's a nice day, so I decided to go for a walk outside. Plenty of other people have had the same idea. I can see a couple of girls, horses by the capes, out for a jog in the distance. And there's a small group of people up ahead having a discussion. No, an argument. Did that guy just shove somebody? I walk closer to see what's going on. Uh, ah, Jacob is the uh, guy on the right. Yeah. You were the one who was all like, Hi, Rain. A mindless, yeah. violent twit. Then, no, I don't. I oh please just l let it go. I don't, I only half remember what I did. It, it was something like dumb, and I couldn't quite get it right every time. Because because we didn't know if it was a boy or a girl. Well, no, I I started trying to go all high pitch, like yeah, you know. <laughs> yes. But I I don't know, so I'll probably not be able to be consistent with this. It's like, what's he got that I haven't got? Huh? A consistent voice, like me, me uh, <laughs> me. consistent voice acting. <laughs> I'm not a professional! <laughs> He's my friend, that's all. Which means he listens to me. Maybe there was new concept for you listening to what the lady actually says. It's the glasses, isn't it? <laughs> Shut your face! Nah, I completely <laughs> lost it that time. Because I, I was like trying to lick my lips for some reason as I talked. Ugh, I have too much spit in my mouth. <laughs> I don't even know how to say that angrily, like, in that tone, because it's, it's not an angry shut tone. Shut your face! <laughs> Suddenly it gets deadly serious, she's like, shut your face! You know? <laughs> and they're like, ah, what happened? Uh. Please, just give me, just leave me alone, this is so embarrassing. Oh, you're fighting over her? Maybe. Uh, maybe he's not fighting over Minnie, but she didn't return his, like, attention, and he's all pissed off about it, and he's like, look, dude. Ah, uh, I think you're right. Like, he's getting jealous when he shouldn't be. Yeah. I mean, maybe she does like Jacob, but... Mm, probably not in that way, though. Yeah. You're the one making a fool out of me! I've done everything for you, and you just throw it back in my face! I'm not. You're killing me. You are killing me. Is that what you want? Is that what it takes to make you happy? You should speak to Damien. What? No. He's, he should speak to Damien. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> because that's what's going to happen, isn't it? You're not leaving me any choice. Admit it. 
Man, back off. Fix your own problems. Gil glares at the two of them, his lip curling in distaste. Next time, you're not getting away! Boy, I made you talk to. <laughs> his fist still clenched. Kyo turns and walks away from Minnie and Jacob. Which means, purely by accident, that he's walking towards me. No, you fool, don't talk to him, Rain. <laughs> um, Just uh, stand aside. Hi, Kyo. Get out of my way! Get out of the way? <laughs> I'm yeah, not he, getting involved in this. <laughs> yeah, he just needs a he just needs a vent. I mean, maybe I could try to be peacemaker here, but I'm like, I do not need to deal with this shit right now. Step aside and let him pass. There isn't a, this isn't any of my business. I probably shouldn't interfere. In the distance, I see Minnie shake her head at Jacob and then run off alone. I started to kind of get a, a feel of what I wanted the voice to be there at the end, but now we probably will never see him on. again. Yep. I'm not sure what I was doing with it, but... Uh, what should I do this week? 